Yo, before we start, it'd be nice if you could like, comment and subscribe. We're a new channel. It would help us out massively and it'd give us more motivation to more, make new videos. Right, let's get into it. So, you've gone out, you've bought a nice new scale electric set for Christmas. And, for instance, your car is not working and you need to change your braids. Or, you've broke your guide blade. First, we'll cover the braids. So, these aren't too bad. But, if you want to change them... I'm going to show you how to do it. So the way I do it is I'll grab the car like this. I'll grab a little screwdriver and I'll just push that towards the front of the car and the braid will pop off. There we go. And then usually in a new set you'll get some extra bra 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 braids. So to put them back on. Same again. Make sure the these are facing the back of the car. Start at the start at the back of the bra the blade. Put it on, and then push forward so it goes over the top, and it should just snap into place. And that's done. Super easy. Dress them up a bit. There we go. Right. That's that. So now. You've been driving around and you realise that you've broken your guide blade. Uh, it's not the end of the world, it can be replaced. You're going to need to buy a replacement part and that is C8312. This is for scale electric sports cars, most standard cars. This is one that Elsa's painted up in a previous video. Uh, so to change that, we're going to do it. So on this car there is four screws. Take them four screws out. My tap. All cars are different. Some cars is two. Some cars is one screw. It all achieves the same result. And don't worry about, you know, warranty or anything like that. I'm pretty sure it won't void your warranty from opening up a car. All right. So inside your car. You're going to need a pair of, I find tweezers are the best. I've nicked these from my wife's makeup bag. And just in here, listen, can you see that? There's a little clip. And I'll, I'll squeeze together and I'll push down at the same time. Now that's out. So. Pull it out and got access to the blade. Now you get a little flat head and I'll just push them off to one side. There we go. There we go. Now they're off. Got my new blade. In this case it's the old one because it's not broken. For video purposes. And I'll just slide it back. In be careful not to bend it because then your plate won't spin properly. That's one side in, that's the other side in. Make sure the longer opening, see, is facing the back of the car, and then simply just clip that back in do a little spin make sure there's no nothing blocking it what can happen is if you damage if you damage this on the other side when the blade turns it can catch on this plate so it won't turn properly but you can see the left right movement there all right and then basically pretty simple body of the car back on four screws back in or however many screws you've got on your car tighten them up you know they don't have to be super tight it's just 
and you'll, f you'll feel it quite easy. Get your new braid over from the back, up, push. There, that's good and ready to go. This car, for instance, has got three screws. It's got one there, one there, and one there. But it's the same principle on the sc this scale electric sports. That's with these. We can cover these blades in another video. For now, it's just your standard blades. Anyway, thanks for watching. Enjoy and have fun.